Falling is a physically demanding job. Daily stretching will increase your flexibility and reduce soreness. Before stretching, warm up your muscles. Go slowly, don't overstretch. If you can't complete the full exercise, do as much as you can without causing pain. Just enough to feel a gentle pull in your muscles. Stretch throughout the day. This will keep your muscles relaxed and minimize fatigue. This stretch helps lengthen the quadricep muscle that can become tight from walking downhill or being held in one position for a long time. Balance yourself by holding onto a tree and grasp your right ankle with your right hand. Keep your knees together and pointed towards the ground and hold your body upright. Apply a gentle pull so you feel a stretch in the front of your right thigh. Hold for 20 to 30 seconds. Don't pull this stretch to the point of pain. Repeat on the opposite leg. This stretch helps lengthen the hamstring muscles in the back of your thigh. With your back straight and your head up, place one leg on a low object, like a stump, no higher than your knees. Keep both legs straight and bend forward at the hips until you feel a gentle stretch in the back of your thigh. Hold for 20 to 30 seconds. Repeat on the opposite leg. If you're very flexible, pull your toes toward your body to get a better stretch. This is an effective stretch for the hip muscles and can be done while standing. Holding on to a tree for balance, grasp your left knee with your right hand. Pull your knee up and across your body until you feel a stretch in the hip and butt area. Don't twist your lower back. Hold for 20 to 30 seconds. Repeat this stretch on the opposite leg. The calf stretch helps maintain flexibility in the lower leg and ankle. Start by placing your right foot against a tree with your toes pointed up and your heel planted. Keeping your back and leg straight, slowly pull your body towards the tree until you feel a stretch in the back of your lower leg. Don't overstretch. Hold for 20 to 30 seconds. Repeat this stretch on the opposite leg. Be aware that cork boots with ankle supports will restrict your movement. This exercise stretches the Achilles tendon. Start by placing your right foot against a tree with your toes pointed upward and your heel planted. While maintaining a straight upper body, grasp the tree and pull yourself towards it, bending your knee. This stretch should be felt in the heel and ankle. Hold the stretch for 20 to 30 seconds. Cork boots may restrict this stretch. Repeat on the opposite leg. This stretch will help maintain flexibility of your shoulders. Clasp your hands together behind your back. Roll your shoulders back and down while pushing your chest out. Keeping your hands clasped, raise your arms. Hold this position for 20 to 30 seconds.
This stretch helps maintain flexibility in your shoulders and upper arm. Raise your right arm to shoulder height and pull your arm gently by the elbow across your chest. This stretch should be felt in the rear part of your shoulder. Hold for 20 to 30 seconds. Repeat on the opposite arm. This stretch helps keep the muscles of the chest wall flexible while maintaining a balanced posture. Place your straight left arm against an object, such as a tree, at shoulder height. Turn your body away from your arm until you feel a stretch in your upper chest and front of the shoulder. Hold this position for 20 to 30 seconds. Repeat with the opposite arm. This stretch increases neck flexibility. Start with your head facing forward. Slowly lower your right ear to your shoulder until you feel a stretch on the opposite side. Hold for 20 seconds. Repeat on the opposite side. This stretch helps maintain flexibility in the forearm. Fallers with previous hand or wrist injuries should not attempt this stretch. Start by placing your palms together and your forearms parallel to the ground. This position may already stretch your forearms. If it does, don't go any further. Rotate your hands downward until you feel a stretch in the palm side of your forearm. Hold this position for 20 to 30 seconds. This stretch keeps the small muscles in the hand flexible, but if you have ever had a wrist injury, don't attempt this stretch. Start by locking your wrist in a straight position. Grasp your four outstretched fingers with the other hand and gently stretch them backwards. Don't overstretch. Hold this position for 20 seconds. Repeat on the opposite hand.